Hello friends, today we will try to solve a particular pro programming exercise using JavaScript. The problem statement would be reverse words in a sentence. This kind of small programming exercise will help you to build your muscle memory into the fundamental JavaScript concept. By learning any resources, books or any tutorial, you know the basic fundamental about JavaScript. But if you don't apply it, so you won't really understand what is the power of it. So this kind of small exercise will help you to apply your understanding into a more practical sense. So the, this is our requirement. So we have a sentence and we want to reverse the by this manner. This is the output. But one first basic step of any programming exercise is to understand the problem much more better and clearly. So the requirement here is the reverse the words, not the letter. So we are not interested to reverse the letter by letter. We want to reverse words by words. So words, if you remember, is separated by space. Space is the delimited or separator between these words. The output will be profile is name my, my. So once you understand the problem, the next step would be to evaluate whether this string, because this is a string. So is there any built-in function available? For example, in string do have so many function. For example, is uppercase, is lowercase, and index of, includes, there are so many. So first you have to go to some uh, Google or do some MDN, Mozilla dev documents to research that this string do have any capabilities to convert, uh, convert me or not. So because there is no need to reinvent the wheel if there is already solution available, but once you go through that, you will realize that there is no standard way to reverse a particular string. So we have to come up with our own solution. The next step would be to create the solution in a whiteboard. You know, you have to approach this problem. You have to think through that what can be the solution instead of before diving to writing the code. You have to try with the various permutation combination in a pen or paper and any mechanism you like. You know, so the, the approach I am following in this example, this may not be the only one solution, there may be many, but this is the one solution I am going to explain for you. So this is our input string. The first thing coming to the my, my, my mind is to split this string into an array because array has lots of built-in functionality available. For example, reverse, which we can leverage for solving our particular problem. So first thing, ooh, there is a split function, which is a string function. So the, if you pass the string, the string called the split function, then it will convert to an array. But what is the parameter or argument we have to pass? We have to be careful as a programming exercise. So if you pass the separator as a space, then this particular string will be converted into the, an array. This array will contain this element. The first element would be my name and so on. The next logical step into that, we have to call an reverse function inside the array. So this reverse function will just reverse that array. Very simple, reverse the array and the element will be rearranged into this format. Profile is name my. So we got this reverse element, but this is not a string. This is not the output we are expecting. Then we, we can you call a join function. This join is not a string function. This is an array function. So this, whatever the output array, we have to call the join and we have to give Join by what? Join by a letter, join by a new line or tab or not. In our case, we want to join by a space again because this is, that is the original, we are separated by space, not a comma or semicolon. So once we give join by space, the profile is name my will be output string. So we solve our problem. Now let's start, see that example uh, in a, this, uh, the programming, how code, how it looks like, okay? So first thing, this is you define, I define an error function. You can create your traditional function. It doesn't matter, but because it is precise, concise, so I feel more comfortable in that. So this is the reverse words. This is the functional expression, which take one argument sentence. The sentence is nothing but a string. JavaScript is much more flexible. We don't need to mention the data type of it. So we can pass, this, this will take as a string, but you know, they can pass a number or anything. So your code will fail. So we have to do additional check for that, but that is some other topic. The first step would be to split based upon that, you know, space. So then it will convert to an array. This words will be an array. So this will looks like my name is profile. Then once we words will reverse it, then it will create another array, reverse words. So this will contain the element in a reverse manner, okay? 
then the next step would be to join then this is join is the function not available in a string function so you have to know the which are the string function which are the array function this is array function then we have to give the separator space then it will convert to a st string so first thing this is the string split split is a string function we have to give the separator so that's where most beginner will confuse which is the string function which is the array function why we need it why we can't do everything string but slowly you'll get into comfortably once you keep on creating you don't need to remember everything you know once you started playing around with this function then you'll get more comfortable day by day you don't need to memorize it but understanding and trying to understand the problem better and come up with a uh, proper solution by hit and trial is the more you know better way just to summarize this split is a string function which will convert to an array so this words is an array reverse is a array function which reverse an array and this join is a array function which will convert back to a string now let's uh, see that example in action so here we have the same function available this reverse words exactly same function split reverse join okay now let me call this function here this is the output which looks correct so if you try to comment it uh, i put some debug statement the first words if you see it is like a array which converted into the individual words if you see this reverse how it will look like you it is the reverse of words so you i always also recommend so you also do this console.log as a beginner so you will get what's going on you know instead of copying the code from stack overflow or some solution you try to understand it even though you copied some place it is fine but programming exercise try to do by yourself you know so if you want to split by just uh, without space so it will split by array uh, element by array element so this is the reversing let me decomment it so here also a reverse string happened but this time it happened by letter by letter because we are not given any separator space or anything so the letter by letter it split it right i hope you got some understanding about the reverse of the string sentence have a good day ahead bye bye